Difference makers around the world from the Wisdoms team, uh, Ivan, Trevor, and Lee here with you. We're going to pick up on some of those questions that we were asking in the previous session and uh, look at some of those situations that spur action, that make people take action to become difference makers. So, Trevor, you are one of those people. So, where do we go from here? Yeah, well, that's that's all my parents' fault. Um, but I I think you know it, you, you were talking about that big project that that uh, I actually did because it was a threat to my family, and I refused to allow that to happen in our community, and it ended up being a huge project. But it's something, Lee, that I always remember about a story that you came back to us with once, and that was you were at this business school with these major corporates and you were being evaluated for uh, the quality of the course material that you were doing. By the way, it was, uh, I'm sure, some of this course material, and I'll never forget you coming back and saying, you know what, there was a woman in this environment that actually came back to you and turned around and said, what she took out of this was that she was going to write a company newsletter. Do you you ever remember that story? I, it never left me about the impact that you made in that business school to a woman who completely changed the way that communication started happening in that corporate. See if it comes back to you. Yeah, I also, it's a very, very meaningful moment for me too, because she was somebody who um, really sat in the background was was sort of hidden. I think by the by the sort of the the bigger, bolder, you know, louder people. Um, and she, but she took action. I think that's another thing that we keep focusing on um, because she didn't just tell me about it. She actually showed me. <laughs> she said because it was a series of of um, workshops that I had been doing. So when when we joined, when we came back for the the second workshop, um, she showed me this um, newsletter that she had compiled. That wasn't just her own work. What she had done is she connected with other people in the office and said, what difference are you making? Who are you coaching? What are you doing in your spare time to reach out to your community? And then found that this person is, is in a, doing a sort of feeding scheme and this person is, is coaching uh, kids coming straight out of school so that they could be ready for university. And um, this person was doing a cleaning up the river campaign. And suddenly, you know, this is now multiplied in and and it's the awareness that this entire office were all doing these amazing things and it was inspirational and encouraging for everybody else and i think that's absolutely fantastic so you know you can go from from a situation of impacting an entire community in a very short space of time to just being a difference maker at whatever level it is and 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 that's what's important here we're not all the kind of people who are going to stand up and take the flack of of taking a huge project head on um doesn't matter you can make a difference wherever you are whoever you are and whatever you're doing and just recognize that uh, they lots of people around you that are doing exactly the same thing and bringing those together just multiplies that effect so that's what we're looking for we're looking for you every one of you wants to make a difference can make a difference is making a difference uh, and wants to be part of something bigger so join us next time what the world needs now i am a difference maker imagine all the people i am a difference maker